Welcome to Variation Swatches plugin by Theme High. With this plugin, add swatches for variable product attributes. Easily customize the product attributes with multiple swatch options. Let's start by adding a product attribute with swatch. Navigate to the Product Attributes tab. After entering a suitable attribute name, choose the swatch type from the type field out of the four options available. Then, start creating terms for the created attribute by clicking on the Configure Terms button. After entering term name, enter valid swatch data for the term. As I have created a color swatch type, I am choosing color for term color from the color picker. Now, let's see how common settings can be configured. Go to the Swatches options, and then Global Settings tab. If the option, Convert all default swatches to label swatches is enabled, then all the attributes without a swatch applied will be converted to a label swatch. The properties of the swatch icon like height, width, border radius and border color can be customized. Set font size and position for the attribute title. The column width of the attribute title and terms can also be adjusted. Of the available swatch types, some of the properties are unique. Such properties can be edited at the Attribute Type Specific Settings tab. For the label swatch type, the font size and colors can be edited here. Other than customizing the colors of the radio button, the radio button style can also be chosen. For the default WooCommerce swatch, select. The Select To style can be enabled. Now, let's see the Active and Hover Style options. From the Active and Hover Style tab, the icon color for Hover and Selected can be set. Similarly, the width can also be set. The plugin provides two different attribute selection Hover Styles, Border Style and Enlarge Style. For the Enlarge Style, the scaling can also be selected. The plugin provides vast options to customize the tooltip for terms. Using the tooltip types like image or description, make it easier for your customer to get details of the variation. Let's see how to apply tooltip for an attribute. Navigate to the Individual Attribute Settings tab and edit an attribute. From the tooltip type field, choose a suitable tooltip type. The tooltip data can be added while adding or editing a term from the corresponding attributes tab. At the Tooltip Settings tab, the properties of each tooltip type can be assigned. The height, width, color, font size and more can be edited for each tooltip types. I will now introduce the option to display the attributes as swatches at the Additional Information tab. Rather than just displaying the attributes as term names, with this feature, the terms can be displayed as swatches. Enable the option, and also, the icon width and height can be adjusted from the Additional Info Settings tab. With this plugin, the Clear button to clear a chosen variation can also be customized. From the Clear Button Style tab, you can edit the button text. The properties like text and background color of the button can be changed. Also, set border radius and color for the button. Feature Attribute is an add-in feature of this plugin. An attribute can be set as featured from the Add or Edit Product tab. The icon height and width for these attributes are set here. The plugin allows to add description for product attributes. Also, these descriptions can be customized by editing the font color and size. Using this plugin, the product attributes can be displayed as swatches on the shop page. Also, enable or disable the add-in options like tooltip and stock left on shop page. Further, align the swatches to suit your theme style. Also, adjust the font size, icon height and width. Other than all these mentioned features, the plugin provides a few more options. Optionally enable clear on reselect. With the option Disable Swatches Plugin Style Sheet, the entire plugin style settings can be disabled. Optionally enable or disable the display of the show stock's left label. Set behavior of the unavailable variation and out of stock variation. By setting the Ajax threshold value, determine the unload behavior of swatches. Like the global attributes, the local attributes is also completely in control of the plugin.
From the Edit Product tab and the Custom Attributes tab, all the settings can be gathered. Customizing your fashion store is this simple with Swatch's plugin from Theme High.